Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna re- Oh my gosh. This is like the 10th time I filmed this intro. Ugh. Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be recreating one of Kylie's 21st birthday makeup looks. I am going to be recreating her second birthday look that she wore on her actual birthday on the 9th. She did a shimmery bronzy eye, which was absolutely stunning. And I know that she used her liquid eyeshadow from her birthday collection and I did not purchase anything from her birthday collection and I don't think I will because I need to prioritize my money right now but of course makeup by Ariel did her birthday looks and he's absolutely amazing definitely check out his Instagram I mean his makeup is always so flawless and beautiful and I loved her whole birthday weekend her Barbie pink themed party looked like so much fun and I was living for her birthday looks and I thought she just looked amazing this year But she always looks amazing on her birthday. I'm always so excited for her birthday looks This is like the 15th time I filmed this intro. So let's just get into the video So I have my eyebrows done and I went a lot more sharp with my eyebrows today because Her eyebrows are always super sharp first I'm gonna be grabbing my dose of colors sassy sienna's palette and I'm gonna go in with this middle shade called foxy so i'm grabbing a really fluffy brush because these eyeshadows are so pigmented that i don't want it to adhere to the brush too much because then it's going to be hard for me to blend out so next just to add a little bit of more depth to the eyes i'm going to mix these two shades which are brassy and stay sassy with a smaller domed eyeshadow brush. So I'm just gonna bring this into my crease and like around my eye, like that. With a fluffy brush and blend everything out. That's all for the matches I'm gonna be applying into my crease. And now I'm gonna take my Makeup Revolution Reloaded Palette. I mean, Revolution Makeup Reloaded Palette because they changed their names. And I'm going to be grabbing this beautiful bronzy shade. I'm going to wet my brush with, I'm really sorry if this concealer is bothering you. Like, I'm sure it will bother me and I'm, I'm just really sorry. <laughs> I'm just going to wet my brush. Swipe this onto my eye. Oh, damn. Actually, it's a lot more bronzy and coppery than her eye okay i'm gonna have to add another eyeshadow over it so now to give it a green tint i'm gonna grab my charlotte tilbury nocturnal cat eyes hypnotize eyeshadow in the huntress because this has a greenish tint to it i don't know if you can really see it well over top yes okay this is exactly the shade that she wore on her eyes for sure going to go back in with my eyeshadow brush and just blend everything out so since she used a liquid eyeshadow you don't need much blending to do with the liquid eyeshadow because you can be a lot more precise with it and hers is more of a half cut crease but because I used a powder eyeshadow I do have to blend it out and you know it does go everywhere but I'm just gonna grab her x-rated blush to kind of mute everything okay i actually regret applying that blush because now it's a lot more peachy why did i even take that i'm not gonna add any more shadow but it did turn out a lot darker than i wanted it to be because around her eyes it's a lot lighter like she really didn't apply a lot of shadow besides the liquid eyeshadow so i'm going to oh, i don't have any more makeup wipes damn you are gong zoo lashes i got these i got this pack of five lashes for two dollars on amazon i'm just gonna stack two of these on my eyes and i will be back i use the physician's formula the healthy foundation and for concealer i use the nyx full coverage concealer in yellow i really like this concealer blend this into my skin For both days, her under eyes were so white. I absolutely loved it. They were so freaking bright under her eyes. I was like, oh my god. Hello! I just want to bake underneath my eyes because hers were really bright, as I just said. And I have a white 
um, loose powder, Revolution Makeup Luxury Baking Powder in Ghost. Okay, so I also lined my upper lash line with the Kai Liner, her black eyeliner in, yeah, it's just black. But this is so amazing. It's the blackest eyeliner I've ever tried. So creamy. The best pencil eyeliner I've ever used. And no lie. Mary Luminizer Highlighter from the Bomb Cosmetics. Yes. I have like up a bit to really open up my eyes. I just applied that same middle brown shade from my Sassy Sienna's palette on my lower lash line. And now I'm applying mascara on my bottom lashes. The Essence Volume Stylist Lash, Ex lash Extension Mascara with lengthening fibers. I just always buy these at Pharmapri. Essence mascaras are amazing. And yeah, I like to let it dry in between each coat. I'm gonna wipe the bake off and set my face with the Too Faced Cocoa Powder Foundation in light medium the urban decay beach bronzer in bronze you know every time i film videos i'm always running out of breath <clears throat> of her blush she did say that she's using a new blush that she's going to be releasing soon for kylie cosmetics so obviously i don't that's it but it was a really light pink blush. I'm going to take this shade from my e.l.f. blush palette. Pigmented. Whoa. And then for highlight on my face, I'm going to go back in with my Mary Luminizer from the Balm. So for lips, I just lined it with the Kylie Jenner Lip Liner in Brown Sugar. Wait, let me just show it. What a beauty liquid lipstick in bombshell. Set my free what? Set my face. I think I did a really, really good job at recreating it. Here's just the eyes. One more time. I'm not used to having super, super white under eyes like this, but I do like the way it looks. But anyways, I really hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Let me know what you guys thought of Kylie's birthday looks, her outfits, and her makeup, which one you preferred. I'd love to know. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe to my channel if you'd like to see future videos of mine. Follow my social media links down below if you'd like. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed. I can't even remember if I said that. Thank you so much for watching. I love you and I will talk to you soon. Bye.